Roe's playing really well. And Roe, you know, impacts the game in so many positive ways. And, you know, especially the way he's been swinging the bat when he's gotten his opportunities. So I guess in a way, you know, it's always hard to keep Gary down, though, because you know what he's capable of on any given night. And uh, so it, it's hard to, you know, sit down one of your dudes. But, but yes, Roe playing the way he is, at least feel like uh, – we're putting in a guy that has a chance to impact the game. And Romine has been red hot at the plate over the last six games. Take a look at the numbers so far. 471 average, eight hits in 17 at-bats. Not to mention, he has managed two homers and he has driven in five in the process. I asked Romine, what's been the difference for him when he steps in the batter's box? Doing a lot of work in the cages with Marcus and PJ. And, you know, uh, I keep stressing just trying to stay up the middle in the other way and, and making sure I get in good counts and getting pitches, you know, I know I can hit and, you know, it's just trying to be consistent with it. It's going well right now and, you know, you just kind of ride that wave, but, you know, just striving for consistency. Aaron Boone said he challenged you before the season saying he knows you're capable of more at the plate. What did you first think when he said that and what did it mean to you that he thought that you were capable of more? Well, it was nice. It was, it was a vote of confidence. You know, they've been nothing but positive towards me, and, and they told me they, you know, they expect more in a, in a good way, in a positive way. And you know, it's, it's nice to have that kind of positivity behind you. You know, you kind of sell out for it, and you know, take it to heart. And you know, you, you really appreciate when guys are saying, you know, things like that about you that they they do expect more from you. So, just adopting that mentality of I can do something for this team and help out when I can. You mentioned the other day after you hit your first home run of the season, it felt like you were an even bigger part of the team being a bigger part of the offense. Is that something that is meaningful to you when you're contributing to feel like you're part of this high-powered offense? Well, absolutely. And you said it. I mean, it's high-powered. I mean, one to nine, we're, we're pretty lethal. And, you know, when you get in that lineup, you want to you be a part of that. You know, being a backup catcher and getting in there every once in a while, it's, it's you, you just want to make sure you can do your job and help help produce for this team. So, I mean, that's all I'm about is helping this team win when I get in there. and. You know, it's nice to, to feel part of it. Austin also mentioned a couple days ago to me that he feels as though experience has played a big role in his success at the plate. He's done this backup role for quite some time now. He now knows how he has to prepare and what he needs to do to be able to put himself in a position to have success when he steps into that batter's box. 